So we're here at Barry Bend Park out by Warsaw, Missouri. And this is where we are doing our giveaway camp trip at, which it is currently Saturday. We didn't do an opening video yesterday, so I kind of figured I'll go ahead and do a video today, kind of show you all the camp, everything like that, and uh, do a run through of the whole setup that we currently have. So behind us here is the main access roadway. That's bathrooms, conveniently located right outside of our campsite. You got a road that goes this way. Then you got a road that goes that way. And it goes down to a turnaround there by the river. It's pretty sweet. These sites are really big. You'll see that here in a second. And, you know, I uh, all around, this is a Corps of Engineers planned siting. And... Everything that's here is great. I, I couldn't have asked for any better better amenities or anything like that. So without further ado, let's flip the camera around and show y'all what we got. All right, guys, here is our setup. Took the car. Here is the full site. Say hi, everybody. So yeah, here's the full site. It's, it's pretty big. Enough room that definitely we got a canopy and more. We got the fire ring over here. Our awning has extended that all the way. The site is pretty level. We only had to use, which I'll show you here in a second. We only had to use one leveling block, but honestly, we probably could have done without it. Kind of a panoramic view all the way around. Ah. And there's the neighbors over there. So over on the back side of the camper here, the utilities area, I'll show you what we're working with. So there's our water hookup, obviously a filter going into the rig. We've got our electric surge protector, can't live without it. Going up into the rig. And we've got our sewer system set up. This side is full hookups. And the drainage slope is perfect. The uh, Corp of Engineers definitely had everything figured out whenever they they built this site. So. so guys, there's the site tour and walk around. I really hope you enjoy the rest of the footage that we got coming up. Where I, we got some pretty exciting things planned for the trip. Kind of. There ain't a whole lot to do in Warsaw. So mainly camp and go check out some of the local sceneries. So stay tuned. <laughs> Oh, cool. Oh, yeah, I can
So we're back at the tension bridge. We got ourselves some locks that we're gonna go and put on the bridge. It's a thing. So we're gonna go do this. goes all right guys we're here at a really nice dump station here at Barry Ben campground and this is this is one of the first that I've seen in person like this so over here this is your cleaning water for cleaning and flushing tanks only it is unsafe to drink and it hangs up there on a valve system has an on-off valve over there. And then there's your actual dump, sewer dump itself. You uh, have your instructions on how to do it. So you would dump there, and then you would drive up a little farther. And then you come to drinking water only, not to be used for flushing tanks. Once again, it's on its own valve system so i figured i'd show y'all how this works out. so all right so we're here on our tank side we're going to go ahead and open that up that is just your water holding tank in i like to leave some water inside of the camper while we're traveling because you never know if we need to pull over and let the kids use the bathroom or something like that so it's pretty much there we are turn the valve on and it's gonna put some water in the tanks i don't fill it all the way up just enough to where we can flush the toilets and wash our hands a couple of times so And I have a leak, it's my valve down there. Always make sure your valve is closed when filling the water. Otherwise it just dumps all over the ground. Anyway, so there's how you do that, guys. Uh, this is the rocks in the water. All right, guys. So we've gone ahead and got the camper all packed up, loaded up, said our goodbyes to Taylor, Tiana, and Caden, and now we are making the journey home. So I guess we'll touch on a few parts of uh, Barry Bend Campground. It is a Corps of Engineers from the U.S. National Guard. Uh, they're who made the campground, designed it, upkeep it, everything like that, and uh, first and foremost, some of the nicest sites that we have stayed at. They're huge. Yeah, they're really big. They've got a lot of room. Um, there at Berry Bend, there are eight campsites that are full hookup, and we were fortunate enough to have one of them. Uh, so, you know, we really didn't have to deal with the wash stations, everything like that, but since we got the kids with us, we're 
going a couple hour ride home, we went ahead and went to the dump station to fill up our water and everything like that, just in case we got to use the bathrooms. Oh, we're good quality dump stations. Yeah. The nicest dump station I've seen. Yeah, definitely, which you'll see, you just got done watching that. <laughs> so, yeah, that was, that was one of the neatest dump stations that I've ever seen, and I guess a lot of people are going to that style, kind of like a, a drive-through dump station and water fill. So pretty unique, pretty neat. And uh, yeah, so I think that's, do you have anything else to add in? The, the only disadvantage Spider. that I could I could say was the uh, the amount of spiders. But there's Plus nothing. Many long legs. Yeah, and you can really do about that. You know, it's, it's nature. You it was should spacious, be. it was quiet, it was peaceful. Our neighbors were a pretty good distance away. Yeah. Yeah, once again, you know, the Corps of Engineers, they designed those sites to be the best out of, you know, anywhere you're going to camp. So no matter where you look, you really had to look to see your neighbors. And, you know, we had one of the larger sites that had, you know, trees surrounding us all over. Um, the bathrooms were right across from us, but obviously we had full hookups, so it wasn't really necessary. But they were there if we needed them. Yes. So, that was nice. So other it is right there next to a tent site, so it would have been nice for a tent camper. Yeah, yeah. To have them right there. Um, oh, uh, one other thing. The sites were pretty much level. Um, and I touched on that in the setup video and kind of showed you all the, uh, the walk around of our campsite. We only had to use one block per wheel. and On one side. Yeah, on, yeah, on one side. Uh, so I was, I was pretty happy with that. You know, we and probably could have gotten away with not even using blocks, but... It was really quick and easy to level front and back, too. Yeah. yeah. So it was pretty much pretty much level. So good sites, good area, good views. So... But all right, guys. Well, we will see you all on the next one. And stay tuned. Up next is the More Out of Life camp trip. So see you all then.